It's one of the most beautiful lakes in Minneapolis, and it turns out that there's an issue that one man is trying to fix. Yeah, Lake Hiawatha filling up with trash, and one man is trying his best to clean all of that up. Fox 9's B.C. O'Neill Erie live in Minneapolis to show us how he's going about it. B.C. Yeah, I spoke to a volunteer who says that pollution here at Lake Hiawatha is a really big problem, and he suggests that those who enjoy spending time here take notice. More than 4,000 pounds. That's how much trash Sean Connedy has recovered from Lake Hiawatha. This is what the soil is like all around here. The University of Minnesota arts professor began picking up trash here during his free time about three years ago. Now he's working to call attention to the pollution. My worst fear is that we'll do nothing. Connedy, who lives nearby, says among several sources of trash, this massive sewer storm pipe. The empties 900 acres of South, South Minneapolis's streets directly into, into the lake. There's no filtration. Over the years, Connedy has recovered a number of items from the lake. He's picked up hair barrettes, lawn chemical sign holders, and even hypodermic needles. Trash is only the visible symptom of the larger problem because we can see the trash, but there's a lot of different pollutants that we can't see. Connedy proposes that the park board look into developing a mitigation system to stop the trash from draining into the lake. There's been quite a bit of delay in taking care of this issue. He says that he's working to rally the community to take action before it's too late. If nothing happens, then, you know, we're, we're throwing away this treasure of a lake, which is a beautiful place. Connedy says that it would be expensive to build a system that would filter out all of that trash, but in the end, he says that it will be worth it. Reporting live tonight from South Minneapolis, I'm B.C. O'Neill Fox 9.